Today we're here with Professor Zhong Gai Wang and Dr. Bronwyn Fox from Deakin University to tell us about the establishment of an exciting new research centre. Well, the centre uh, is going to be called the Australian Future Five Research and Innovation Centre, AFRIC. Uh, it, it is a joint um, um, initiative between Deakin University, the CSIL and the Victorian Centre for Advanced Materials Manufacturing, or VCAM. And can you tell me the area, different areas of fibres that the research centre will be looking at? Yeah, we'll be focused on four major areas. Uh, the, uh, one is carbon fibres, another is nano fibres, uh, also green natural fibres and smart fibres materials. So those are the four focus areas for the new centre. Bronwyn, you work specifically in the area of carbon fibre. Can you tell me a little bit about carbon fibre and why it's such an exciting fibre? Carbon fibre composites are widely used in the aerospace and automotive industry because they're extremely lightweight and very high strength. Aside from that, they also have the ability to be tailored into to give you the properties that you desire from any particular application. So they're incredibly tailorable. We're moving from digging materials out of the ground now into tailoring them and manufacturing them from the bottom up. So it really um, is the way of manufacturing materials in the 21st century. And what are some of the directions that you'll take, will be taking in the new centre? We're very interested in um, aerospace applications as well as automotive applications. I think automotive applications for carbon fibre composites will become increasingly important as we move to hybrid and electric vehicles where you need a much lighter weight structure so that you improve the fuel economy and the, the energy efficiency of these vehicles. Um, we're very excited about improving the toughness, enhancing the adhesion to, from the fibre to the matrix and also tailoring the, um, the coatings of the fibre so we can get very sp specific properties. Professor Wang, what are your hopes for the outcomes from the centre? I think it will uh, put us um, on the map, not just in Australia but more importantly internationally, as the um, key centre of excellence for research into fibres and fibrous materials. The, the thing with DIP is that we are quite unique in that we have um, a very multidisciplinary approach to uh, our research activities and the group we have here have expertise in quite f uh, diverse areas in fibers and textiles, in compasses, in polymers, in nanomaterials, in biomaterials and also in intelligent systems. So there's no other place uh, in the university system that I can think of that has a, a, a multidisciplinary group in, uh, such as ours.